The Columbus Zoo and Aquarium is home to over 10,000 animals representing over 600 species. Some of those animals came here facing hardships and challenges that prevented them from survival in the wild, sometimes at the hand of human and animal conflict. As the human population in our range expands, humans are repurposing land for our own benefit, which results in shrinking habitats for wildlife and the displacement of those species into human inhabited areas. People might think it's only an issue of animals encroaching into human areas, but it's actually a much larger issue. Many animals sustain injuries from human-made objects and other human interference. However, there's some great news too. You can be part of the solution to help humans and animals coexist. Ronaldo is a black vulture, one of our animal ambassadors here at the Columbus Zoo. He was actually a wild bird who sustained an injury, most likely from a car hit. Ronaldo actually wandered up to someone's back porch and the well-intended homeowner started feeding him. Um, they didn't really quite understand the extent of his injury until after several days had passed. When they finally brought him into a local wildlife center, his injuries had healed incorrectly and due to that, Ronaldo is now considered to be non-releasable. Luckily for Ronaldo, he found a home here at the Columbus Zoo as one of our animal ambassadors. Black vultures are an amazing species that are crucial to our ecosystem. Black vultures are often called nature's little garbage man because they are nature's cleanup crew. Ronaldo now serves an important role here at the Columbus Zoo. He can help us educate others on how we can interact safely with native wildlife. Caring for injured wildlife on your own might seem like a great idea, but it can actually hinder their chances of survival, rehabilitation, and release. Here in Central Ohio, we work with the Ohio Wildlife Center. Look up your local wildlife center so that you're always prepared. Thanks so much for watching. Join us next time for more tips on how you can save the planet at home.